The Ministry of Interior on Tuesday inaugurated the board on the National Commission on Small Arms and Light Weapons at a ceremony attended by officials of the ministry and other stakeholders from different sectors. The Executive Secretary, Ibrahim Akambi, explains the goal of the commission. Our goal, enhance public peace and security through regulation, control and management of the circulation of small arms and light weapons and other related materials, which are the major tools for any arms conflict, gun violence through advocacy and uh, public sensitization to raise awareness. One of the objectives of the commission is to contribute to the provision and enhancement of the internal security for women's safety, protection and peace in the country. The database here, we must have a comprehensive database of all the weapons, small arms, that the army has, that the police has, whether it's PIU or national police, that the SIS has, any armed unit in this country, whatever the weapons they have, as long as they fall under the category of small arms, we must have a database. We must register all of them in our central database here. And this information will be transmitted to ECOWAS. The mandate of the Commission is to manage all issues and matters relating to small arms and light weapons. When you set up an institution, you must have some values in your institution. You don't just set up an institution and leave it like that, open, no. Our core values in this Commission will first and foremost will be honesty. We must strive to uphold the highest standards of trust and integrity. Integrity is very, very important in this Commission because we are dealing with life and death. Weapons. If we do not have the integrity to tell people the truth, to apply the law as it should be, then we are not going anywhere. Mr. Kambi said the Commission would advise the Interior Minister on the formulation of policy strategies towards the implementation of provisions combined in the ECOWAS Convention. So it's the Commission's responsibility to advise the Interior Minister according to the Act in in his attempt to formulate policies and strategies that will go to the National Assembly for ratification or approval. Receive, we also, is our responsibility to receive, study, and analyze reports from the Gambia Police Force on the registration and licensing of arms to inform decision and policy formulation. The Commission exists to combat and prevent the proliferation of small arms and light weapons and related materials in the country. It is also part of their mandate to coordinate national implementation of the Equas Convention on Small Arms and Light Weapons, their ammunitions and other related materials. The Commission also meant to ensure the Gambia's compliance to the United Nations Firearms Protocols. Reporting for Kerfatu, I am Bubagajiwa.